Hi everyone, good morning. My name is Katie Mert and I'm the Associate Director of Undergraduate and Transfer Admissions at LaSalle University. Hi everybody, my name is Colleen Boyle and I'm one of the admission counselors here at LaSalle. Hi everybody, my name is Steve Duzinski. I'm an Assistant Director of Admissions here at LaSalle University. I've been here at LaSalle University for the last two years, but I come from a LaSalle family, so LaSalle has always been in my heart, and I'm so excited to be part of the journey to assist you in becoming a LaSalle Explorer. Um, I have been here for about four to five months, but I also am a re recent graduate of LaSalle University. Um, this past May where I studied both marketing and management and leadership. I've been here for a bit. I actually graduated from LaSalle University in 2015 and I completed my MBA here as well. Feel free to click that Q&A button and ask us any questions you have and we'll make sure to get you some really awesome answers. Thank you guys so much. We'll see you later. So the short answer to that question is no, you don't need to submit your SAT scores. Um, we are going to link a article down below that shows the requirements for the freshman application, graduate application, and then the international transfer application, so check that out. Hi guys, it's Katie. I'm back to answer the question, what makes a good fit at LaSalle? Or what type of student are we looking for when we review applications? I love this question. I could talk about it forever, um, but I'm gonna try and make it nice and concise for you. The three pillars of a LaSalle education are faith, service, and community. So I find that students that really thrive at LaSalle University are students that have a heart for community service and students that are really interested in getting to know their peers in the college experience. So community building and getting to know the people around you and in your classroom, if you enjoy those things, that makes a killer LaSalle student. We really are looking for students that are ready to contribute to the community that we are building right here at 20th and Olney. Um, and so that's something that's very important to us um, as we review your application. Of course, an interest in academic challenges is gonna be important as well. Your college experience is definitely gonna be filled with a lot of academic uh, ups and downs and just kind of, just kind of navigating the process so students who are also ready for an academic challenge make a really good fit but that heart for community and community building I think is at the core of what makes every LaSalle student successful so that's something that we're always looking for no matter what high school you're coming from or what college you might be transferring from what state you're from or what country you're from students that are interested in getting to know the people around them and the city around them and the world around them by extension make the best LaSalle explorers. Yes, there are different ways that you can apply to LaSalle University. The first way is an early applicant. If you apply early, you should have received a decision roughly before Christmas. And if you decide to apply regular decision, regular decision applicants will come out roughly at the end of January, early February. Now, we are also rolling admissions, so we do try to get applicants' uh, decisions out as soon as possible. But if you do have any questions, please, reach out to us in the admissions office and we can check on your applicant as soon as possible. Thank you. You can figure out who your admissions counselor is by logging in through your application portal. And on the right hand side, it's gonna be the name and contact information to your admissions counselor. And then you can email or text them with any questions that you may have. Hi guys, Katie again, this time with a question about transfer admissions. So the question was, is the process easy or difficult to transfer to LaSalle um, if I'm already attending another college or institution? And the answer is, we do our best to make this process as simple as we can for you. So we're gonna require an online application form. You can apply through the common application and it's totally free to apply. Then we also ask you for a copy of your college transcript so we can see the college classes you've taken already and help you find out what those will transfer into um, as courses at LaSalle. So having a copy of your college transcript is probably the most important step in the transfer admissions process so we can let you know what classes are going to transfer. We can accept up to 70 transfer credits for students that are transferring to LaSalle from another institution. So if you have um, up to 70 credits, we will evaluate those for transfer. And if you have more than 70 credits, we will bring in the ones that will best match toward the degree program that you're selecting while you're here at LaSalle. So you're going to need that online application form, a copy of your college transcript and depending on how many credits you've completed let's say maybe you've only done one semester of college so far and you're already ready to become a LaSalle Explorer then we may also ask you for a copy of your high school transcript at that time too but we no longer require any standardized test scores in the transfer admissions process and me Katie will be in touch with you throughout the transfer application process because I work directly with transfer students who are looking to come to LaSalle so you'll be hearing from me a lot if you are a transfer student okay so the question was 
How can you visit LaSalle University? Well, there are two ways that you can visit LaSalle or ask about visiting. Number one, you can go to our website and go to lasalle.edu backslash visit, and you will see a calendar with all open dates for you to visit. Select the date in which you are interested in and time, and just register yourself. Or if you want, you can call us in the admissions office and let us know which date you are interested in visiting. Now, keep in mind that this Monday, January 16th, we do have an on-campus open house. It is a fun day to see the campus in person, meet with admissions, faculty and staff, and even other students. There will be financial aid sessions, and again, there will be tours of campus as well. Following the open house, there is a basketball game where you can go as a student and see our basketball team play. Again, we in admissions will be there as well, so please, Come visit us and let us know how else we can help. So what is it like at LaSalle? I can definitely say that LaSalle is a very welcoming and friendly environment. I can guarantee you that if you walk through the quad or through one of the buildings, you're going to see somebody that you know. Um, with the 19 D1 sports, there's also over 100 student activities and clubs to join. You're always going to see something in the quad or you're going to see students um, tabling in the union, things to sign up for, flyers everywhere. So when I tell you that there's plenty of things to do on this campus, there is. Um, you don't want to miss it. Um, so just really get yourself involved on campus when you get here. And yeah. All right, the last question that someone asked was, how do I find the scholarships that LaSalle University offers? Uh, you can simply go to our website at lasalle.edu backslash financial aid backslash scholarships. There you will see all our scholarships that we do offer, but do keep in mind that we do offer merit-based scholarships when students do apply to LaSalle. Also, make sure that you do complete your FAFSA as you are or you could be eligible for additional grants but make sure that you do talk to your counselors in your high schools because they will also be able to guide you to additional scholarships. Again, please call us in our office and let us know if you have any other questions. We will be more than happy to help you. Thank you guys and have an awesome one. Thank you guys so much for joining us today for the admissions office takeover. I hope you learned a little bit more about LaSalle University and I hope that we were able to uh, get you excited about the possibility of becoming an explorer. If you have any questions in the future or there's anything you didn't get to ask today, you can always contact us in the admissions office. Um, you can reach us by phone, email or text, social media as well. Whatever you need, we're here for you and we really hope to be able to help you on your journey to becoming an explorer very soon. Thank you so much for tuning in and we'll see you again soon.